We're just finishing up here at the churro bar. Churro bar. <laughs> also known as a chocolate bar. Man, that was good eating. <laughs> so wrong. So wrong. So wrong, but good fuel. This is gonna keep us going. Oh, I see people outside with umbrellas. This is not good. I'm sick of wearing my raincoat. Green for rain, ready to go. Yeah. Can you believe that if we were in a car and we hopped in the car right now and drove, we would be in Santiago before the sun came up? Yep. 12 minutes. <laughs> Romania and she's on a limited time schedule and she has been doing part bus like from Ankara but she wanted to walk the whole thing from Syria Syria but she was asking about what it was like to walk all the way she didn't think she could do it because she felt like she would give up or want to quit and if you think about it before we started, 30 days seemed like a long time. I've never felt like, oh, this is getting older, this is boring, or I'm tired of this, or I want to quit, I wish it was over. It's gone so quick, and now all of a sudden it's four, four near the end. It's like, how did we get here so fast? It's a lot of fun. It's a beer garden. What do you expect? <laughs> oh, and it's all Peregrina bottles.
This is episode 39? Yeah. Mm -hmm. Is that possible? Yeah. Episode 30. That means that we've been on the Camino de Santiago, the Camino Francis, for 32 days. And that doesn't seem possible. It doesn't yeah. either. Mm -hmm. But here's the, the clincher. We're a day's walk away from Santiago now. An easy day's walk. Oh, please don't. <laughs> don't jinx it. Oh, no, no, I'll be in the rain. <laughs> don't jinx it. So I'll be in the rain. It's pouring yeah. down right outside. And we are so thrilled right in this moment. It's 5.30, and, um, and we're warm and dry indoors, and it's raining outside. We did get rained on, but, um, but it was right before we stopped for lunch, so we had a nice hot meal after that. Yeah. So um, well, how about the day? What do you, what do you think? You start out in Malib, which is kind of a just a I can't know, even remember Malib industrial scene. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. You had a nice yeah. coffee on, went to the churro bar for yeah. breakfast. That was a nice part of Malib. Donuts and coffee. I know. <laughs> that was excellent fuel. <laughs> yes. So and we ended up here in Abrea, which is a very small town. Just uh, like I said, a day's walk from Santiago. So it was uh the 18.1 miles, okay. um, you know, those gentle rolling hills for about 2,000 foot of elevation and just shy of 3,000 calories, so. So that pizza we had for lunch? And the churros for yeah. breakfast, yeah. it's just fuel, it's gone. Yeah, we had a great pizza. It that was really good. And we demolished lunch. our pizzas. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, it wasn't a lot of talking going on during lunch. We thought about time lapse, but it would have gone in an instant. Yeah, <laughs> it was too fast. Boy, that was good pizza. Though. That was, it was uh, great. It was, it was warm. We had a little bit of a wait, but that's okay. We dried off a little bit during that yeah, wait. That was nice. Yeah. And we powered through the afternoon, which was still seven miles to go. Yeah, yeah we, we averaged a three, three, uh, three mile an hour average for the day. So. Yeah. A trusty yeah. leader. <laughs> <laughs> They're just it's letting a, me think it's, on. It, it's a good thing she twisted her ankle. <laughs> It's the rabbit. Yeah. But it's really pretty. It's a green tunnel a lot of the time. It My is. Yeah. AT, it is today. Well, it's just up and down. They aren't steep mostly, but uh, lanes between the farms. And a lot of trees planted on the side. Eucalyptus, oak. But they often make a really t nice tunnel, which in the summer would be a it welcome be. shade. It's, it's real beautiful. Yeah, it's it's so quiet and peaceful. That's a, It's a real, real nice part of the country to be in. Um, very agricultural. We got out of the lead really fast this morning. It was kind of a surprise um, how quickly we ended up back in farm country. Yeah. 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 Well, and the other weird thing is sunrise is what? 8.50. 8.50, <laughs> yeah. yeah. Um, and, and there's not a lot of activity. It's, you feel like it's 6 o'clock in the morning because right. there's, there's no people out, there's no cars. And it's like, it's wait, wait a second, it's almost 9 o'clock. <laughs> yeah. Where is everybody? Yeah. Actually, there haven't been. I'm surprised at how few yeah. uh, peregrinos we've seen on the trail today. It's weird. We got a couple weird clusters yeah. of folks that. Yeah. And, just, and, and we yeah. Have, and there, <laughs> we have, haven't seen people that you know normally you, you leapfrog or you see. Right. And it's it's yeah. a complete different set of uh, people. Yeah. It's interesting. The Brazilian that we met at, at lunch who mm -hmm. was doing the yeah. primitivo. Um, and at this point, those. Those have merged because we're so close to Santiago. Yeah, so that was uh, that was interesting hearing his comments on yeah. that, where there was virtually nobody on it and lots of up and down. Yeah, yeah. I don't know if we've mentioned it before, but there are a lot of caminos that converge on Santiago. This is the most popular one and the well-known one, the Frances. But they all through Spain, through Portugal, all and, through Europe, and coming from other countries in Europe. But yeah. they. They all converge along coming into Santiago. Yeah, it's been really interesting. But yeah, um, I missed seeing a few folks that we, we've been seeing a lot. I think yeah. I owe that to that three mile an hour pace. Yeah. I mean, I think we've just really, um, we're just really striding out. Yeah. And it, I mean, it's not like we're trying to finish this quickly, but when it's this rainy and this cold, that quick pace keeps you warm. And I think that's kind of, we're all, we're all trying to keep a pace that just keeps us keeps our metabolism up and, 
allows us to eat churros and chocolate for breakfast. Yeah, and when the percentage chance of rain keeps going up as the oh, day wears on, we want to use less and less of the day to actually get where we're going. Slider kept well, saying, don't stop. We want to get there before the rain. That's right. And we did. And we did. But, but, but Good job. A, and a lot of people we talk to that they don't have reservations and they walk until either they're tired or it gets dark or it starts raining. Right. And then they, they find some place. So or today we would have stopped at 11. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Well, yeah. then we could have had a second beer or a second glass yeah. of all the wine with the pizza, <laughs> and, and I would have been fine with that. Yeah, we may have, a couple of us may have had alcoholic beverages with our lunch, but it takes the edge off the afternoon. Yeah. It's all fuel. Yeah. We're, we're, we're here. Gasoline, no poor It's not only beer. efficient fuel, it's very cheap fuel. Yeah. yeah. Actually, another thing we're enjoying along the, this last section in particular, I mean, You've seen a lot of pictures of churches. There's a lot of famous churches that we've stayed in and cathedrals, but all the towns have a little church, and especially starting at Saria, because there's a, pilgrims have to get two stamps per day. A lot of these little churches have a volunteer in there uh, giving a stamp. They're so friendly and welcoming, and you know. And uh, they're, they're these pleasant. tiny churches, mm -hmm. so they haven't gone to the electric candles. So you walk in and you get that, mm -hmm. that warmth and the smell of the candles is just an ambiance to those little churches that you yeah. can't get in those magnificent cathedrals. Yeah. They're very welcome warm and welcome. Yeah. 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 It, just, it okay. just feels special in there. Yeah. Just, yeah. And, and it's not, you're not overwhelmed by all the, the gold or the, right. the altar pieces of the stained glass. It's just a very warm presence and a very personal you can really focus on the little details, and, and you're intimate with those little details. And, and also now you'll see in almost every church they have uh, a statue of St. James. Yeah. So, and that's the highlight of this area, but it, it's an interesting aspect to uh, see. Yeah. Uh, so, um, a magic moment for today, about an hour and a half ago, two hours ago, I started fantasizing about having a cup of hot tea with lots of sugar. And we come up to the top of the stairs here to our room, and sure enough, there's a teapot, a tea, tea kettle in the room, and there's tea just outside the door. So I got my cup of hot yeah. tea. Well, and my why, magic why, why too. Couldn't you visualize or be wanting a, a cold glass of beer? Actually, there's a bar downstairs, so you're in luck. <laughs> as soon as this is done, we can we can. Are we talking I, like one track mind over there? Maybe a little bit, but I think he's calorie deficient. Yeah, yeah. it's a cold day. Fill it up for yeah. tomorrow. Yeah. Yeah. And you know that 3,000 calories, that does not account for metabolism for the, the temperatures. Yeah. So we're in 50 degrees, it's breezy, oh. it's it's wet. Two beers. Yeah. So, so, sounds good. I'm just, now Don't just encourage your, <laughs> I'm just defying your dinner, and if somebody <laughs> offers you churros tomorrow, you say yes. <laughs> uh, so counting little blessings today, uh, like the scent of the eucalyptus trees. That was yeah. really beautiful. Yeah. Um, the dark forest. The forest was was kind of spooky. You know, you it really, was mythical. You yeah. really see oh, where the legends. the the legends and the stories yeah. come from. The haunted forest, or yeah. the branches coming alive, or yeah, especially the chestnut trees. Yeah. Those, oh, those things are really evocative. Yeah. 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 Um, I was also counting blessings like hot pizza for lunch, yeah. <laughs> and the fact that you're healed enough to walk three miles yeah. an hour. Yeah. And um, dry so shoes at the end of the day. Dry shoes, yeah. Yeah. Um, yeah. We have warm radiators this morning, so we put on our shoes and socks. They were all warm and dry. That was that yeah. was a real blessing. Yeah. And, yeah. So and actually, despite everything, it was a beautiful day to walk. It Perfect really was. temperature, and yeah. you know, it was really, really nice. None of the hills were killers for us because we we can do hills. Yeah. 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 Up and down. I just won't yeah. let her up get ahead yeah. at the down bottom down. of the hill. <laughs> I will keep up, and then it's not so bad. <laughs> Catching up is hard. I'm the old one in the group, so they're just trying to make me feel good. Yeah. Yeah. Honu is just an ironic nickname. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. We have to change up the strider. <laughs> okay. Any, any other blessings today? Anybody? Find any? It's a beautiful day. It was just yeah, it was. a beautiful day. The temperature is in the 50s, so it's even though, and our rain gear works well, so with just a couple layers, we're comfortable, and it's pleasant walking yeah. temperature. Okay. Mm -hmm. okay. So we ended today 25 kilometers from Santiago de Compostela. Yeah. Mm -hmm.
25 clicks. 25 clicks to go. Yeah. Exciting. Oh, and um, shout out to Maddie. Um, I, I hope you saw some of the animals yesterday. A couple more animals today. Yeah, every time I see them, I photograph them for you. You want to say hi to your moms? Hi, Mom. Hi, Mom. Hi, hi Karen. <laughs> hi, Elaine. Okay, well, what do we say? Oh, Australia! Australia.